I'm Phoenix City Councilwoman Kate Gallego. We are in Levine at the grand opening of the Arizona General Hospital, and I'm here with longtime community leader Fern Ward. Thank you for being here on this important day. Can you tell me a little bit about what this hospital means for Levine? Oh, we are so excited to have the hospital here. We've not had any kind of health care. I've lived out here 35 years, and the closest hospital was either Maryvale on 51st Avenue and Indian School or having to drive all the way to Good Sam on 12th Street and McDowell. So this is its comforting, to say the least. Yes, as an elected official, it was so hard to hear the stories of what happened to people when they needed medical help. If I could interrupt you there, my son, had an asthma attack when he was in seventh grade, and we ended up having to drive him to Maryvale Hospital, and he was airy-backed over to Good Sam. Um, when he came back to school, I had to check with the school to see what kind of care they could provide him if he had another asthma attack like that. They referred me to the fire department. I went to the fire department, made sure they knew how to tr treat an, a severe asthmatic, and that was, that's not a comfort zone any parent ever wants to be in, knowing that you have to call the fire department every time your child has an asthma attack. So this is absolutely wonderful for everybody in Levine. Well, thank you for taking that difficult experience and helping us as elected officials advocate to bring the hospital Oh, thank here. you. <laughs> and they've been amazing in the community. Um, they, Dignity stepped right up and volunteered to be our premier sponsor at the Levine Barbecue, the 63rd annual Levine Barbecue. And they were just an absolute hit out there. They, they have blended into the community more than is so quickly. I can't imagine what it was like before they were here. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> they've been supporting our schools, they've been supporting our arts, yes. our events, and it's great to have them here. So we're looking forward to a long and continued partnership. And thank you for being here with us today to mark this important occasion. Thank you for bringing them here. It's appreciated. I'm here with President and CEO of Dignity Health in Arizona, Linda Hunt. Thank you for joining us on this important day. I'm thrilled to be here. Can you tell us a little bit about how the hospital came to the Levine area? Well, we knew Levine needed health care and needed more than urgent type of care. They needed inpatient and they needed emergency care. So we worked with Adeptus Health out of Texas to begin to look at where could we locate this facility. So Dignity Health and Adeptus began looking at the Levine area and we thought this was a great location and we sealed our relationship and started quickly in a matter of a year we had this hospital up and open and just blew our projections all away that we thought we might see 15 to 18 patients a day within a very short period of time we were seeing the 50s 60s and now up to the 70 number of people who are coming through our doors and we're saying wow did we build too small of a facility and we're looking at what next we need to do Wonderful. Well, we are very glad to have you here, and we just heard from one of the many residents who had a story that was difficult to hear about how hard it used to be to get health care right. here, so welcome. You are. We are celebrating this ribbon cutting today, but you also have a major anniversary coming up. Can you tell us about that? Yes. March 19th, 2015 is 120 years since the Sisters of Mercy out of Burlingame, California, came to this valley to teach and then decided to open a hospital at St. Joseph's Hospital at 4th Street in Polk, and now we're at the corner of uh, 3rd, 5th Avenue, and Thomas. So we're excited, 120 years of serving this community, but really about improving the health of everyone who comes across our door. Wonderful. Well, as someone who's been a patient during that 120 years, I am very grateful to have you here and want to welcome you to the Levine area. Great. We are looking forward to a long partnership and we want to tell you we really appreciate you being so involved with the Levine community already. You know, the people down here have been just spectacular to work with and so appreciative. And we're thrilled to bring our excellence and care, but most of all, our human kindness to this community. Well, we are very happy to say hello, human kindness, today. And thank you for joining us today. I'm Phoenix City Councilwoman Kate Gallego, and this is On The Go.